United States uh, Olympic prospects, the amateur team. He fought internationally 21 times, but he gave it all up to turn pro. And as somebody said, you certainly can't eat medals and trophies. <laughs> His professional boxing record is one win and two defeats. Edward Rackley. His opponent coming out of the blue corner, weighing in at 138 and one half pounds, wearing red trunks with a white trim from Dallas, Texas, undefeated through his first two professional bouts, both by knockouts, Cedric Rose. Rose, a young man, I love the line by a writer in Biloxi, Mississippi, when he defeated an East German there while fighting for the United States last November. He's a very mild-mannered young man, Rose is, and he called him the Mellow Rose of Texas. Oh. <laughs> and here he is in his third professional fight against Rackley, who's into just his fourth. Round one, it is scheduled for six, and while that may not sound like a very long bout, it is for a man who's fought all his career as an amateur and ended his first two professional fights before the end of the third round, and that's what Cedric Rose did. And we had Cedric on his second uh, pro fight in one of those knockouts against not a great opposition, as it doesn't look like Rackley oh, here. Rackley walked into that and went down briefly, and will take the count of eight from the referee, Dickie Cole. Now that Rose fight I alluded to was in Lake Charles, Louisiana, one of our favorite stops in the ESPN trip. And right now it looks to me like he's going to do away with Edward Rackley as quickly as he has his other opponents. Rackley keeps on coming with those long arms. You talk about throwing a punch from Australia. He's throwing his from some other planet I don't know. And Edward Rackley is not the most stylish fighter we've ever seen here on ESPN. I think we can say that. He's down again. That'll be the second count, and that'll be enough for the referee, Dickie Cole. He has seen enough. Rackley is taken out by Cedric Rose, who ends it very, very early. And Cedric Rose, all the class, certainly in the ring between those two. And his seasoning, his experience, fighting for the United States against the Soviets, the East Germans, the Cubans, where he acquitted himself very well, winning 19 of 21. Looks to be on his way to a good pro career, but you couldn't tell by the opponent he had tonight. Well, indeed, that was the case in Lake Charles also. Uh, I think that even in his first, second, and third pro fight, Cedric Rose better face better competition with all that amateur experience it's ludicrous for him to be facing these kind of fighters really he continues